What, 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 what up, people of the world? Special Caesar here coming at you with more sweet video game absurdity, folks. Welcome back to Battle Brothers. We are carrying on with our Northern Raided 100,000 crown achievement run. And I couldn't be more excited to be bringing it to you guys. We just got another trading caravan to kill, so let's dive in and start immediately, because it's a super easy fight. Uh, sorry I wasn't online in the end yesterday with more war tales like I anticipated. I forgot that they were coming towards us. Oh well. Should be fine. Uh, I ended up getting tied up with a bunch of stuffs. Stuffs and things. That uh, I had to do. So I wasn't able to get online like I wanted to. By the time I'd finished doing all the stuffs and things that I wanted to do, it was quite late in the evening and I already had evening plans. So I decided just to not stream in the end. I should have waited there. What am I doing? Nice decap. This guy. There's quite a few more of them than I thought there would be. Lance, good morning, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Tyler the Leper, how are you doing, mate? Thank you for joining. I hope you're both well today. Get off that hill, boy. armor. Especially not his armor. Wouldn't mind this guy's armor, actually. That's 80 armor. We are wearing all metal. We don't need it. Well, if we can dagger him down, then I will. Let's see what happens. Yeah. One more hit and he'll break, and then we can surround him. Or one more movement and he'll break. Chetty. Jelly bear. Oh. There you go, he broke. Doing well, haven't been home from work too long. Oh, so you just got back from work. Congratulations. On a hard day's slog. Put your feet up, sit back, relax, grab a cold one. And uh, enjoy us for Battle Brothers for a while, for as long as you can bear. Yeah, we got the HF. Finally, some fucking decent stuff on the caravan. Three furs, that's what I'm talking about. Two arming swords, another 130 helmet, another 80 armor. We're full, bloody hell, okay. Don't want those crap crossbow bolts, don't want all this shit armor that didn't sell for anything. Definitely want the furs, want the meat, want the. Cr okay. Okay, I see. I see what's going on here. Okay, what's next? 
These are 50. We're actually running low on helmets, aren't we? No, we're not. We've got tons. Okay, so that's fine. We don't want any of that. Don't want any of that. We want that. A couple of daggers would be nice for some new... Oh, although we've got that dagger, so fuck them. Shields, according to how repaired they are, come next. I think short swords are the next best thing. I don't know. I actually don't know. It's all garbage. But that was finally a good haul of uh, something worth attacking. That is the first trade goods we've got, guys, since it started. It's looking like I didn't survive. You're here. What are you chatting about? You're... There you go, Tyler the Leopard. In fact, you leveled up, bruh. You're getting closer. I think you're the closest to max level. So first, let's do rubbish, attack, defense, and health. Uh, he's got fast adaptation. I'm going to give him gifted. So he got even more attack, defense, and health. Leper, Tyler, attack, defense, and what are we building you as? I think hit points. You've got 93, that's pretty good. You don't even have Colossus yet. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to fit Colossus in, so... Let's go for more hit points, just to make you super beefy. You're falling apart, but you've got tons of hit points. So you live, you live for ages and just suffer. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Light tank, defense, initiative, and hit points. Uh, dodge, blah, blah, blah. he gets shield mastery now, let's push defense up even more. 42 defense, very nice. We can start using him as a front line now. At least a little, to a certain degree. Uh, he gets the nice new dagger. Shitman? Yeah, I suppose Shitman can have it. No, this guy's got higher attack. He has it. Uh, my bad, I didn't see. No worries, mate. Sounding more and more like reality. Yeah, exactly. I just want to repair that. We want to use that on someone. You. Which means you now get that one. Which means the next 105 goes to you. Because I want everyone in metal helmets. That means you get that. And you get the 100. You get the 70. Do we repair this? Probably not. I think we've got enough. One, two, three. Yeah, six cleavers is enough for undead. My day's been fine, thanks, uh, Tyler. Thanks for asking, mate. Um, I've literally just woken up. Got up, had breakfast, had a shower, did a couple of things, and now I'm diving straight into streaming. I expect to go for a good four or five hours today till about two o'clock. I've been uh, testing some stuff offline as well. Just uh, checking out. Stream. Checking out a few ideas and builds and things. But it's not been going great, to be honest. The computer's been whitewashing me. I had to restart several times as the, uh, as the band of poachers. They're going to follow us to Alstad if we're not careful, so we need to go. We need to just come down this way. Which is a shame because Alstad is where we wanted to go sell. Missing villagers. Disappearing villagers. We need tools. Problem is, if we go somewhere where we can sell, we need to go to Alstad, sell, and then come down to Rothberg and buy tools. If we go somewhere that we can sell high, we can't then buy tools because tools are stupidly expensive. We have to go somewhere we can sell high to get loads of crowns and then go somewhere where the prices are cheap to get cheap tools. So that's going to take another couple of days. So we're wasting a lot of time here, unfortunately. Yeah, it's 3.20 a.m. here in Alabama. I work nights. Ah, okay, cool. You are a perfect example of the type of subscriber that I was talking about the other day to Chetty, I think it was. He was asking if I had a stream schedule and I said no, primarily because... I stream when I can, and my work is a rolling rotor, 
So I don't know when I'm off work. Uh, I don't know. There's no set pattern to my work. It's not like I work nine to five, five days a week and then have weekends off. I don't have a set routine. And on top of that, a lot of my subscribers are people who are around the, the globe. Oh, nice. Collectors are here, so that should drive up prices. Yeah, brilliant. That's good. Um, I can't remember what I was saying now. Let's sell all this strange meat. 172, that's fine. We'll keep all the rest of that. Uh, yeah, the subscribers are all over the world. So, oh, there's Chetty. How you doing, mate? Welcome to the stream. Have you taken on any green skins? Not yet. No, it's a little bit early for green skins. But we're gonna get it, we're getting pretty close to being able to take them. Morning, Chaddy. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Thanks for joining. Lance, how you doing, mate? Oh, yeah, you were already here, weren't you? <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, because subscribers are all over the world, they have different time zones. And also, some people work nights. So there's no, like, set day or night streaming schedule for me. I just stream when I can, and people who are around can catch it. What well, are selling prices? Yeah, really good. We don't need two of these axes. One can go, that can go, that can go, that can go, that can go. All of these shields can go. We'll sell the Nash Sarah horn since it's worth so much. We're going to keep the direwolf pelts because they're more valuable. <clears throat> so down to a decent amount of food. Oh, we need to get rid of some of these hats and armor things and stuff as well, don't we? What's the best we've got? 50, right? Yeah, 250s. I think I'll keep the 250s. Yeah. Uh, keep the 75 and the 80, sell the rest. Keep the spear. We don't need the falchion because we've got arming swords. Oh, these are only selling for 234. I think I'll keep them until they're selling more like 280. bros for hire, I don't think there are. We've got a bit more cash to splurge now. 270, cultists can actually be really good. We still need one more bro there to go camp busting, but we've actually got a bit of cash. So I might start rolling on the, oh no, we need a retinue member, don't we as well? Hang on, let's, spend the, let's buy the retinue member first. Who are we getting? <sighs> Blacksmith would mean that our arm, we could get into fights more quickly. And also, the armor that we've got wouldn't get destroyed. So we've got full sets of armor for all the men now. Pretty good armor as well. If one of the men dies, we'd have to replace that armor. If we keep the blacksmith, then... No, I don't find the blacksmith is that useful. Uh, well, I mean, you can just replace the armor you have with armor that you have in your inventory. Uh, I really want the scout, obviously, but we still need two more beasts against battles. Uh, two more battles against beasts before we can get the scout. I think I'm going to just save for the scout. Follow the tracks for 470. We are going to do that. Although, no, we've got, we've got no fucking tools. Who's, who's actually repaired, needs repair? Okay, we're doing okay. I think we can do a follow the tracks. We should be able to do this follow the tracks one without an issue. Too much of an issue. Follow the tracks. Accept. Good, they didn't go into the marsh. That would have been fucking annoying. There's blatantly going to be a necromancer here, actually. I didn't think about that. It's a one skull for 470. This shouldn't be a necromancer. 12 thieves. Good, no necromancer. Good, just thugs and poachers. That's fine. Poachers are a bit annoying because it means they're going to hide up on the hill. We have to go up the hill at them. And they're going to be more accurate. By like 20% more accurate, which is really irritating. Yeah, the hilltop's bullshit. They've got a really good position. That axe I don't like. Might as well start charging.
the, the backliners aren't going to be able to hit either because they can't hit up two things. They've got a perfect hill formation there. That's really fucking irritating. I have to be keddy, ke keddy. I have to be careful with where I play you guys. That's fine. Don't want to step there because then he can step down and swing. Don't particularly want to be under someone, but we're going to have to be under someone at some point. Come up there, so you're ready to go up there. You're literally useless in this fight because you can't hit up two things. Go there and shield wall. Yeah, he steps down. That's fine. You can now step up and attack at least. Miss. Don't like that dagger being above him. He could punch her easily. Um. Shitman can go here and stab you. Don't care if shitman dies. Helmet, you need to come up here. We all have headgear apart from all the ones up here. Yep, shit man getting fucked up like I thought he would be. You can now go up here and fuck him up. I'm gonna get lots of attacks off on us. This round's gonna suck. This next round is gonna suck. There's nothing I can do. I have to just charge at the hill. It's fucking annoying. There's the puncture. He's going to run on 28 because he's above him. We need to kill that guy immediately. Good. Well done. Should be safe now. Headshot. No. Uh, it's lucky he dodged. We're going to lose a bunch of our armor because they're stupid fucking hill position. How bollocks is this? What a load of bullshit. Caravan man missing twice. Making breaks, he didn't stun anyone. We're gonna knock him back. We're not. Shit man, shit. There we go, they're broken. Right, you can charge up there, an adrenaline rush. We can come up to here, let's block down the archer. He's tied, he's tied, you can go here and tie them up. Uh, he's on him, so you can step up and get this guy. I think they're all tied up now. Motherfuckers, denting our armor, how dare you! Oh, he's got a dagger, he could puncture again, that would really suck. Yeah, these fucking these little shits. These little shits need to die before they puncture us. Or you miss. Miss again. Those punctures are fucking terrifying right now, I'm not gonna lie. Camera man, I guess I see if you can break him. Fucking puncturing pricks. 
Go away. Thank you. Right, all good. We need more fatigue. We need to start pumping fatigue. The long, slightly longer fights and diff more difficult fights like uphill are proving challenging because we don't have enough fatigue. So we need to start pumping that. That's literally a load of trash to sell. Paid to return it because we want the prices to be good. We want, the, we want to be remain friendly relations with them because we want to be... Our stat is really good selling post for us, post for us. So if we keep the relations on Allied... We'll get good sell and buy prices. Collectors are still here. No, maybe we should have taken that thousand actually. This was literally a load of junk. Apart from the dagger. Oh, I sold the food by mistake. Fuck's sake. Whatever, we had 161 food. Oh, that needs to go as well. That is fine. Where did our army... Oh, it's there. Yeah, where did our other army go? That needs to go. Um, what was I doing? Putting the dagger on someone. Who has the shit one? You do. Shit no one. Shitman level up as well, so terrible rolls. What do we expect on Shitman? Gifted, at least he gets a bit of attack and a bit of defense. Whoops. Thrower gets attack, fatigue, and initiative. He's got fast adaptation, he gets exit no, he gets steel brow to keep him alive against crossbows. Repair that. Sell that. That's in door, and that we can do because we're going down that way to buy tools anyway. Question is do we want to hire any of these bros? I don't think so. We've got a bit more cash now. I want to hire someone decent. Don't want to waste it on trash. Damn it, that place is going to be closed. We can't do any contracts. There's literally no point in going to Dornheim. Oh, I missed the trading camera because I was looking at chat. Would you say that Battle Brothers is one of your favourite games? I know it's a dumb question. Uh, it's not a dumb question. I can have lots of uh, games that I like, but I do. I have put a lot of hours into Battle Brothers and I do enjoy it. It's very satisfying. It's very frustrating, but satisfyingly fun. And there's a lot of, um, yeah, well, you've got a load of different backgrounds. There's a lot of replayability in it, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, but this is probably going to be the last campaign of Battle Brothers I do because I've done all the campaigns I wanted to do, if that makes sense. I've done all the starts I wanted to do. We want this guy's armor. We want to bosh down his head because he's not wearing any head and he's got a shield. This will probably be the last uh, run that I do. Just because I've basically completed Battle Brothers as much as I can. Oh, fuck is going to try and puncture him again. Before he punctures. Oops, we need to double click, but that worked anyway. Oh, the low armor goes against the spear, don't like that. Good double kill. It's fine, we're all good. 
Actually, I should get this guy's armor, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'm going to try and get this guy's armor. Because he's barely wearing a head. A head? He's barely wearing a helmet. And he's not very dangerous. It's a great opportunity to get some 95 armor. So effective. Caesar, would you okay play the Legends mod? Uh, I'll think about that. Uh, the thing about the Legends mod is it adds a bunch of stuff that's just really imbalanced. It's just super powerful, and it makes it, it makes the game too easy. It's a bit more fun. It's a bit more silly and enjoyable, and lax. But I like the challenge of Battle Brothers, and I like. Um, I like beating it, basically. But I might consider it if I don't have anything else to play. Like, if I have literally nothing else to play, and uh, I'm struggling to find games that I'm enjoying, then I'll probably play it. But I've just basically had enough of Battle Brothers in all its, in all its glory. Uh, I've done everything I wanted to do. The Legends mod adds a bit of extra stuff, but it's still the same concept. It's still the same... Style, the art style, the music, all of it. I'm just a bit tired of it. I'm ready to move on to something else because I've been streaming it a lot over the past few months. I've streamed a lot of um, Battle Brothers over the last year, I suppose. I understand I have four kids. They don't live with me, though, but I understand how you feel. Yeah, kids are exhausting. It's great. They're great, and you love them to bits, but they're just so tiring, aren't they? Uh, perfect. we got the two armors. We've got some wood. Got some tools. So the 95s, you can wear a 95. I don't want some. Because it's nimble gear, I want to just keep it in my inventory. I don't want some dumbass shit rubbish guy getting killed wearing it. Early beast gets attack, defense, and HP. He needs more HP because he doesn't have very much. Hmm. I think 80 is fine actually. I did, I did just say we need to start pumping fatigue, so let's start pumping fatigue. Damn it, this guy got a pierced arm from that fucking puncture. So tools go instantly. Oh, I just, I, it didn't make a sound. Oh, what the fuck? Well, we're going to run away. It didn't, um, there was no trumpet to announce that there was an enemy on the road. I was looking at chat, and then next thing I know, I'm under attack. No one heard a trumpet, right? It wasn't just me. We need to get to Asendorn, though, so this is the best way of doing it. Just going through and retreating. Don't go down, you pillock. You can get caught, aren't you? Yeah, he's coming for you. If you're not careful, you can get caught. I bet he goes up now. He goes, no, I'm going to go this way now. Fucking idiots. Good, they're all out of sight. As long as they're out of sight, they don't follow you. They don't chase you. They just skip their turn when they're out of sight. They know they can't catch you. <coughs> There's another game like Battle Brothers, but has magic and really heavy fantasy base, but can't remember what it's called. Um, yeah. Iron Oath? So there was no fucking announcement on the road. We're gonna go here and then we're just gonna leave. Ah, oh, disappearing villagers, that sucks. There's a hunter for 1500, that's quite expensive. But we do still need a sniper. We can't do anything here. I was gonna buy the dyes, but we've got disappearing villagers and we've got we're being chased by people. We're gonna do something crazy, guys. We're gonna save it.
and we're going to do an experiment. We're going to take this Hunt Down with Terrorizers contract and we're going to drag it into this this enemy patrol. And we're going to see if we can kill both of them. This is just for shits and giggles. Gain Renown. There they are. Web next. Oh, perfect. It's going to be a, a perfect matchup. Watch. It's going to get all of them. No, we messed up. Okay. We need to run away again. We need to run away and let the spiders come in and attack us. And that'll be a four-way bonanza. It'll be a four-way slaughter fest bonanza. The Iron Oath. I think that's what it's called, but is any good? Um, oh, don't go down. You're going to get caught. One, two, three, four. Luckily, he's still out of range. Uh, I haven't actually played the Iron Oath. It's still in early access. I did pick it up and take a look at it. And I was planning on playing it instead of War Tales. But it wasn't, it was still, because it's in early access, it was still very early in its uh, development and it didn't have enough content, I felt. A lot of comments were saying it's a great game, but there's not very much content in it yet. Wait until the full release kind of thing on the review section. So I'm, I'm going to pick it up. That is going to be a title that I'm going to play at some point, but I'm going to wait until more content comes out for it. Yes, praise Davkul. Right, we're going to get these spiders in and we're going to do a massive fucking fight against the army. And we're going to try and take the army out while the spiders are distracting them. Oh, this, there we go. Oh, we got it. So, some footmen, a few billmen, a few armlessers and a plethora of webnecks are coming at us. Oh, we've got the help of these guys. This is fucking weird, guys. I don't know. Where are the enemy? Where are the fucking other guys? The 29 or the, the two that we're fighting. Where the fuck are the... Uh, what's it called, guys? The army. Are they not here? Are we just fighting spiders? I've never done a battle like this before in Battle Brothers. No, they're definitely around somewhere. Does that mean these guys, these conscripts, will help us with the enemy army as well? This is fucking crazy. I don't know where the enemies are. This is I've never done this battle before. That's why we saved it. Because, uh, yeah, this is going to be interesting. Maybe I should fall back, actually. No, I want to fight with these guys. I want these guys to help me. I want them to be alive. I want them to live long enough to help me with the um, these guys. Shetty. Shetty. Come here. Oh, nice. Okay, so they're coming in. I wonder if they're going to attack these guys. If they're going to attack each other. Raymar, come here. Oh, there's eggs there. This guy's just fucking naked. Just naked pitchfork, man. Doesn't give a shit. He's like, whatever, man. I'm naked, so what? Good. They've got a couple of spiders on them. They've got some spiders spawning up there. So we have to clear out these spiders as quickly as possible. Then rotate upwards and round. And kill these fuckers. While they're distracted by the other spiders. I don't think these guys tie up them. Yeah, they just move. So these two aren't fighting. It's these two who are fighting. That's interesting. No point in adrenaline rushing. Good kill, caravan man. Good kill, Markov. Very nice, boys. We've got to kill these guys quickly. Yeah, get in there, mate. Get in there. You do that. You do you, buddy. Uh, 
Okay, so yeah, we want to move up with these guys. Whoa, good shot, mate. We're slaughtering these spiders. Perfect. Problem is the nine soldiers we're going to have to deal with. Oh, they got spiders on them and stuff, so that's good. Uh, Lance can come. I don't, want to put any, I don't want to put Lance in danger for no reason, but I don't want this guy to get tied up. Lance can come and kill that guy. At least there's only two spiders down there now, so we should be okay. Aha, this guy came here by himself on his own. Perfect. Okay, so that's interesting. The the two AI, the AI is the spiders are against both the human and all the humans. These two humans are allied, but we're against the green humans. And these guys are against. Oh, it's so funny this fight. I love it. Morning, Balasas Vyazkoski. Sorry if I butchered your name. One second, guys. There's someone at the door. I'll be right back in just a moment.
Right guys, I'm back, sorry about that. Someone at the door trying to fix the front door. Didn't know they were coming. But we're back, we can carry on with this awesome epic battle. Play Xbox mainly, yeah. I like dark, gritty, horror themed RPGs. Me too, Tyler, I love that kind of stuff. Like Darkest Dungeon things, I think you guys mentioned it earlier. Uh, play, yeah, I really like Xbox Game Pass as well. The only problem I have with the Xbox, uh, the Xbox Series X, you can't stream to your computer and it hasn't got it enabled for some reason. If you try and stream, you get audio coming through, but then you just get a black screen. And the reason why is they haven't programmed it something and then they don't intend to either. Whereas with the old Xbox, the Xbox One, you could stream directly to your PC. Anything you were doing, it was so useful. Thanks, Tyler. Right, what are we doing? Shitman is down here. We really need to come up and start dealing with all the guys at the top. You're definitely stepping up and fucking this guy up. Uh, yeah, come up and deal with these guys up here. Spiders are tanking very nicely for us, giving us a chance to kill some of these fuckheads. Problem is they get confident when we kill the spiders as well, so they're going to have confident footmen, they're going to be really hard to kill. <clears throat> so yeah, I love the Xbox, and I've got a pile of games on there that I want to play, but I also want to stream them while I play them. And because that computer, you know, Xbox to PC streaming software isn't enabled because it doesn't work, I'm just not able to do it, which is really fucking irritating. And now I've got a ton of games which I'm just like piling up on, which are just piling up on me on the Xbox that I need to play. <clears throat> See now this spider's going to be confident, which sucks. Oh, he pulled away. That's annoying. I wanted to catch him. I wanted to gut him while he was down here. They're all confident. Shit, we're going to be fighting nine of these. I don't think this is doable, guys. I don't think this has worked the way it was supposed to. Because this caravan came, on, came along on top, it changed the dynamic of the fight. Which means we're basically, we're all killing the spiders together, and then we're going to have to kill the army to get by ourselves. If these guys weren't hit, excuse me, if these guys weren't here this caravan wasn't here what would happen is the spiders would spawn at the top and at the bottom and the enemy army would spawn in the middle and if we fell backwards the spiders would fight the army kill most of the army but the army would win and then we would fight the army that's what i was going for Has anyone played War Tile? i played War Tile for a bit i didn't mind it but they're bringing out a new game that looks even better that looks even cooler than uh, it's like an RPG fantasy game. I played the demo a bit a while back on the on the stream actually on the channel. Uh, I can't remember what it's called now, but it's the successor to War Tile. War Tile was okay, but I thought it was a bit flat. There was something missing in it. I didn't I didn't play that very much of it, but I really like the art style. Uh, ever tried Game Pass on the PC? I didn't know they did Game Pass on the PC to be honest. Have about eighty percent of the games from the Xbox on PC? Do they? Do you have to pay for that as well? Because I'll have to cancel my other subscription if I'm paying for it. If you, uh, or if it's a free service, then I can just... Yeah, this isn't going to work, guys. <laughs> this hasn't worked the way I want to do it. It's an epic battle, and it's funny, but... The spiders are being slaughtered, making all of these guys confident. And these guys don't fight with them like we do. So we're just going to get harassed by spiders. And they're going to kill all their spiders because they've got AI helping them. I don't know. What about Banner Saga? That was good for the first game that they brought out. I didn't really enjoy it after that. I don't know why. It annoyed me the way it just randomly punished you for a decision that you didn't know was bad from at the start. You'd make a decision and then like a few episodes later something would happen and you'd be like, oh, based on the decision you made before this bad thing's happened. And it's just like, oh. I didn't know that was coming and it just best fucked you up. I don't know. Maybe I didn't give it a chance. 
we need to get up here. We need to come up and start killing these guys while they're still engaged with spiders. Yeah, see, they're not engaged. Fuck, massive hit on Chetty. Fucking headshot. Chetty best bro has fucking steel brow, doesn't he? That's the only thing that saved him. No, he doesn't. That is why you get steel brow, guys. Look at that fucking damage. His one fucking level saved him. His three hit points saved his life. That is why you get steel brow. Always. Fuck, that's such bullshit. And the spider's gonna kill him. Can't do anything but charge with shit, man. Yeah, they're crushing these spiders. Ah, oh, why did you miss? You missed twice. Of course you did. If you have ultimate, it's good use for X. Oh, Xbox Ultimate is more expensive, isn't it? It's a couple of quid more. I might look into it, but yeah, I've got no problem paying the money. I just want all the facts. Uh, come up on the high ground. I don't really know what I'm doing with this fight anymore. Leave Chetty alone, you asshole! Stop bullying him. I don't really know what I'm doing with this fight anymore, to be honest, guys. Like, I don't think we're going to be able to do it. So, I'm like, I'm kind of not paying attention to it. I'm too busy looking at chat. Creepy spider death sounds. Mate, spider deaths is like music to my ears, bruh. Good, they'll tank the spiders for a while, but we're not going to be able to deal with this. All the spiders are gone. They've got rotate, so even if I go in here and hit this guy, they're just going to rotate him out. Yeah, he's retreating anyway. Uh, we can maybe slaughter these three, but I, I seriously doubt we'll get through their shields and armor in time. Let me just make sure he doesn't kill that guy. Chaddy, for your life! Nope, double miss. It's three or four quid more, yeah. Only one thing sounds better than the spider death. Goblin death. You're not wrong, my friend. We're just heading into heater shields. We don't have any alternatives. We can't... We don't have any ranged weapons, so we can't hit over the top and kill the back line. Oh, yeah. Kill the Arbalist. Very nice. All we can do is just hit into fucking heater shields. What's that guy? That guy's just running around with the club. Good, you saved Chetty's life. Yeah, this isn't good. He's just gonna fire on this guy and kill him. Tyler the Leper's got like no armor left. the last spider. You're done. That spider tying up the arbalister is good, but it's not gonna keep it's not gonna go for long. You know what I mean? He's gonna be He's going to be done soon, and then he's going to be fucking us up, the Arbalista. The spider's already running. I don't know why he didn't change back to his crossbow, actually, and fire. That's weird. He probably should have done that. I've got no more weapons, and I press finish instead of D by mistake. Yeah, these guys just these guys just got in the way, messed up the fight, and then changed the dynamic of the fight as well. They haven't actually helped at all. We can wait. <coughs> Uh, 
Do I bump him back? I think I do. And step forward and that frees this guy up. You're here to come here and bump him back in case he needs to. Problem is these guys are going to come in as well now so... Rubbish can't go there, he'll die. It doesn't matter where he goes, he's going to die. This guy has the most armor out of everyone, but that's a triple surround. If I go here, he'll rotate. I think we just go here and wait. He's going to step up. Yeah. Yeah, Rubbish is going to die. Yeah, this sucks. Now we're just basically fighting the fucking nine army. Like, we should have, except they're all confident and we're all half dead. We should have just fought the nine army by itself. So it didn't work the way it wanted to because this stupid caravan came along and got in the way, unfortunately. Well, nothing for it. Just got to go. Just got to go, man. <laughs> 52, 34. <laughs> Yeah, Arbalist is back. He's going to start caning someone. Probably this guy. Oh, thank goodness that was a hit. Oh, these idiots are now in the way of the fight. Like, talk about fucking everything up for us. I don't need to bump that guy back. Oh, what a dick. These fucking idiots are really annoying me. All right, one second, guys. Someone's at the door again. Right guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. They were all done and there should be no more disturbances unless something else unprecedented uh, occurs. Um, Tyler the Leper, you're going to die by spiders, you reckon? There's a possibility. It is a possibility, yeah. Like, fuck for that. I'm so glad he died. Right, there's only three of them. We can do this, boys. We can do this. Just keep fucking stabbing. Rubbish, block with your shield, not your face. Good blocking. Ah, oh, he took a recover, that's fine. Oh, he just nailed rubbish. Uh, you're coming up here to kill the Arbalister before he can... F oh, he didn't, have an, he didn't have a big one, okay. I was hoping that would break some morale, but they just do not care. No one liked the Arbalister, apparently. Oh, we are getting some lucky hits in here, boys. Oh my god, that hit. Unbelievable. Don't give me hope, game. It's giving me hope. Owie. That would be beneficial, I think, for the adjacency bonuses. No, stab him in the body, mate. Good kill. Okay, he just rotated around. So that's lucky. That was a head hit. Because he knew he was about to die. That's what it was. This guy is still confident. He's still like, yeah, I'll take you all. We got some really fucking jammy hits in there, guys. I'm not going to lie.
And Fortune was with us in this fight, and that's made all the difference. And still, we still haven't won it. We can still lose it easily. We can still get someone could easily get crushed, but we're getting close. Good, he's no longer confident. Right, I don't want this guy to get head hit and killed, so you can stay out of the fight. You've got no more armor. You just have to go. Right, we're just gonna while he's attacking somewhere else, we're just gonna go for it. Yeah, motherfucker, you're mine. Oh my god, we did it. I don't know how we did that, but it fucking worked. Oh my god, my super crazy all-out risk plan actually paid off. Look at that loot, boys. I'd never let you die to spiders, Tyler, never. You're my boy, Tyler, you're my boy. Bickety boom, we get it all. Plus, we finish the mission, which means we can go back to Atendorn and everything will be super cheap, or should be much cheaper. Yep, apart from tools, of course. We're gonna buy the dies, guys, because we've got enough money to do it, and we're gonna take them down to the bottom place and we're gonna sell them. To make lots of money. Round of drinks for the boys. Good work, man. Right, let's see what we got. Uh, a male coif can go on the thrower because he needs it. We got two more 230 helms. Fucking sexy. 230 helm on you. 230 helm on you. And then... 125s, 125 on you, 125 on you, 125 on you, you only just survived that, and that was fucking lucky. Oh, uh, there's 125 there as well, so we all got metal hell, oh no, you get it, sorry. You get that one, you get the 125, actually you get the 130. And the other noobs get the 130. Very nice. Very nice. Good work. Arming sword. Yes, I will repair. Thank you. We got two pikes. The fucking arbalister bow we can sell. A heater shield. Another heater shield even. So, who actually uses shield? Just the new... Our uh, best bro can have it. Cheddy, you almost got pwned by that crossbow. It was pretty bloody close, Cheddy Bear. Pretty bloody close. Proceeds, uh, proceeds to cry in a corner. Oh, Tyler. Don't cry. Come and drink with us. Cavern Man could do with a weapon, couldn't he? He's got 60 attack, not that good. He could do with an arming sword. Not an arming sword, they're too expensive. He could do with a falchion. That's like a backup weapon. Actually, I'll give him a spear. Fuck it, yeah. He needs a spear. He's only got 60 attack, so that'll take him up to 80 at least. Plus it's cheap. Uh, we've now got some pikes, so we can hire some backline. If we get some backline guys or some bros that we actually want to keep alive, we can put them in the backline. And uh, do we hire this hunter? Fifteen fifty. I think we do. We need to roll on every hunter we find, right? Because we need a sniper still. I just wondering if you guys were able to listen to my story, the voice in the van. Oh, sorry, Tyler. I haven't had a chance to, but I will note it down now, mate. Writing it down on my phone, and I will. It's on YouTube, right? You just listen audio story on YouTube. I will check it out some point this afternoon when I finish the stream. The voice in the vent.
Yeah, I will check it out this afternoon, mate. Thanks for reminding me. Yeah, we are going to roll on this archer because we need a sniper. Oh, shit. He's a backline guy. He's trash. Absolute trash. Well, he's another thrower. Yeah, high initiative. He's got one star in his attack, but no one cares about one star in melee attack when you've only got 53 attack. That's irrelevant. Um, so he's another thrower. So this is Markov. This is Espen, our thrower. He gets attack, fatigue, and initiative. And we're going to give him students so he levels up faster to catch up with everyone. He's going to get a 90 armor. No, you can have a 95. Fuck it, why not? He gets... Throwers can have these helmets. So he wants a nimble helmet. So he can just wear the heaviest helmet at the moment, actually. And he goes there like that. Do we have any more arrows on anyone? Yeah, we've got loads of arrows. What am I doing? Keeping them off people. We don't have any throwing weapons, do we? No. Uh, who has the other arrows? You do. So fuck it. May as well just give him all the arrows like that. For the moment. So he's going to be our new thrower. Oh, flail man leveled up. Attack, defense, and fatigue. Keep swinging at the head. This guy's coming on quite nicely, actually. Flail spec. it. Shame that hunter was shit. Still, we've got plenty of money incoming as we go south. We need to buy tools and we need to buy, we need to hire another hunter at some point. We need a sniper. Yes, Oddly Dark Tales reads it on YouTube. Cool. Looking forward to it, mate. How long is it? Just so I have an idea of how much time I need to put aside for it. 11 Nash Zeras. That's probably worth killing for expi- Oh no, we're, we're fucked up, aren't we? We just did a big fight. You've got no armor. Oh no, I've got no tools. Yeah, no, fuck it. Chetty's dead. So let's not get into a fight now. Right, cheap tools, please. Thank you. Two, four, six, eight. One hundred. Pick up some cheap grain while we're here, so we've got enough for nine days. I'm tempted to buy the bird. But I'd rather see what bros there are at the moment. There might be a hunter here. There is. Orton the hunter. We're going to hire him. We have to roll on him, guys. That'll give us enough money to get down to the thingy and sell. So all the money we just made, we spent on hunters and... Oh, fuck. He's huge, which is a bit irrelevant. It doesn't mean anything. But he doesn't have, he's only got one star in fucking, right, he's going to be our sniper, but we're going to be a lookout for another one. He's not going to be very good. We rolled badly, unfortunately, we rolled really unluckily. Why are you huge? That's so irrelevant. It's 20 minutes, okay, cool. Cherry died. Hello, Matthew Tan. Who's Cherry? You mean Cheddy? No, Cheddy's still with us. He almost died. This is bullshit. Fucking health, fatigue. Once, if only he had three stars there. That's all that matters. That's all you want in, a, in an archer. You want three stars there. Maybe a couple of stars in fatigue and a star in initiative. That's it. You don't care about anything else. It's a shame. 90... You need the coif, so we're going to swap this. Since you're a thrower, actually, you can wear the helmet. You can wear the nice coif. Since he's a high level thrower. There we go. So we just extended the back line massively by adding a bunch of throwers. Which means the light tank is going to have to move into the front and actually tank.
Shady Best Row can go there. Should we actually bother with this guy or should we just get rid of him? It's going to cost us 20 a day and he's probably not going to roll well. He's going to finish on about 90 out of 100. I like, I like my, my snipers to have like 110. I don't know if we should bother leveling him. He's going to finish on about 90. I prefer to have 100 to 110. Oh, that's so annoying. Why has he got fucking stars there? It's just like, ugh, 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 ugh. It's horrible. Well, whatever. We've made our choice. We have to know. We've, we're full of bros, so we need to just go and um, sell. Go south and sell. We can probably kill. No, he's still repairing, aren't we? We still, we've got enough tools to foot the bill. Now we need to actually pay the bill, and that takes time. Can't get any fights with fucking 75 armor missing. Actually, we probably could have taken that fight. I could have swapped some of this armor out, couldn't I? There's an 80 there. Probably could have done it in 80. Although he's still almost dead. Everyone else is fine, actually. It's just this guy. You can wear the 80 till that repairs. Which isn't brilliant, I know, but whatever. 110 repairing. If we don't repair that, how much is the bill? 34. So it's gone down. This is 40. That's 40 tools right there, look. Oh no. It's gone down quite a lot. Oh, whatever. Whatever, let's go. So we can get in a fight, actually, after all. What have we got? Some outlaws and an archer. Six of them. This might be a good opportunity to get some outlaw gear. Can't fight. Seven, some cutthroats and an outlaw. Well, we're going to go for the seven that are coming towards us rather than the ones that are running away. Oh, we should bench you to heal then, I guess. Yeah, we've done that. Yeah, we benched him. He's not on this fight, I don't think. Is that him? No, that's shit, man. Oh yeah, this guy needs to die. Do we want his armor? 105, I don't think we care about it. We want his sword though, so we're gonna kill him quickly. We're not gonna try and dagger him down. Caravan, man. Oh, I should've shielded. Why am I not adrenaline rushing, for fuck's sake? He hit me twice and I missed him twice. That's not a good start. Look how much damage that sword does. Good shot, Ortwin. No, oh, Splay's dead. We got the armor because it was a headshot that we killed him in the end. And it's 105. All right, not bad. Take it. 
better than something it's better than what he's weighing at the moment if it's fully repaired 74 is 78 yes yeah, but that's an 80 he's weighing so it's about the same what's this early banner attack whoops Res yeah attack resolve and fatigue good uh, I wonder what our ambition is at the moment we don't have one. We need, we need the Rally of the Troops thing. We're going to save his perk in case the Rally of the Troops ambition comes up. And then we can just go boop, Rally of the Troops, and we're done with it. Do we chase these idiots? I don't think we do. They're going to go quite far off road. Um, everyone's still... F oh, this guy got fucked up as well. His armor got a bit fucked. I think we just leave it and head down to the uh, I want to keep that because it's nimble gear I don't want to give it to anyone in case they die any of the shit guys in case they die like this guy I don't you know or him not him, that's Lance. Oh, the other guy died, didn't he? Rubbish died in that last fight. Let's just go. It's dawn. Yeah, they're going to run off over there. And we'll check. We'd have to chase them over the hills and then they'd be over like here somewhere and just... Then we'd miss the knights. Oh, good. They got a good harvest. Not that that matters, actually. Who cares? Uh, selling prices aren't brilliant. Yeah, 226. 17 is okay, but it's not great. We could risk it and go all the way to the other place. Is there anyone here worth buying? Gambler for 100. Let's see if he's a good... Uh, what's it called? Bannerman. No. It's got two attack. It's got initiative. Yeah, but his attack's so low to begin with, it's just not relevant. We'll get rid of him. Three skulls. Right, see, there's nomads somewhere, and they just haven't generated. It just hasn't generated fucking ambush trade routes from it. It's really annoying. So food is super cheap here, but it doesn't. It's irrelevant because we're not gonna. Yeah, we've got plenty of food, basically. Let's go all the way to Quadim and hope they have ambush trade routes. We're still repairing as it is. We might find some hyenas. That would be good. No, five brigands. Yeah, that's a good opportunity to get some loot. Why have we not got an ambition? We haven't had an ambition prop up for fucking ages. Oh no, we just completed it just back at the old city, didn't we? We completed it up here, didn't we? So it hasn't been fucking ages. It's still been a couple of days. I thought we'd get them. We'd get another one by now. Uh, interesting. We want this guy's armor. Let's just see where they go. We want all their armor, but they're dangerous. So this guy needs to die. We don't really care about his armor. We want this guy's armor. We want this guy's armor. And then the other three can just die, I think. Yeah. Spare wall. Face off against this guy. Finish. 
Uh, you're quite badly hurt. I'm going to need you to dagger at some point, but come here for the moment. Because I don't want you getting hit. Uh, shoot this guy. Up here and throw at no one, because I don't want you chunking the armor. Oh shit, I just shot and this guy's in the way. I was hoping he'd be dead. That's annoying. Okay, cheeky javelins. Where's he going? He just skipped his turn, alright. Okay, let's see how this can be done. Right, that needs to die first though, good. Then you spear wall again, there. You shoot at no one, because there's no point. You shoot at him. Yeah, pick him down so he dies on the spear wall. Uh, shit man, come here. You step up, swing, an adrenaline rush. You step up and finish. You step up and start daggering. And come to here and throw at this guy. Good throw. Now he has to do something. Oh, he's fucked now. He's fucked now. Right, this guy just needs to die. Good. Yeah, the second one was a headshot. I, I used this one which to try and hit his head, and then he didn't have enough fatigue for it, so I just did a normal attack, and I hit him right in the noggin. Splat! Dead fucker. This guy just needs to die. And this guy we want to dagger down. Why are you destroying the helmet, you fool? Good, punch him. Don't want you to just run in when you don't have a dagger ready. You just run in and punch her. Oh, sneaky, sneaky cheeky. Sneaky cheeky fuckers. You need to come up here now. You need to wait. You can stab and try and kill him. You can shoot and try and kill him. There he goes. You can get your dagger out. And stab. Good. You can get your dagger out and stab as well. Your armor's mine, boy. There's no saving you. Two armors. The flail. Very nice. Load of crowns. Spooky spiders. Oh, Flavius, what's up, mate? Welcome to the stream, buddy. Thanks for joining. Damn it, it's going to be night. Yeah, just so we get there. But they do have ambush trade routes. And we can drive off. So perfect, we can sell here in the morning. Sell in the morning, then drive the nomads off for the mission. Everyone's euphoric, yay. Okay, good. There we go, Shlaim a sergeant to rally you on the battlefield. Perfect, now we can just go boop, boop, boop. Rally the troops, boop. Job done. You're much better now. Reduce range, skill, and vision. No one cares about that. You're fine. Oh, it's still lower than the other prices. That's really annoying. Well, we'll go back and hope they have ambush trade routes when we go back there. Let's uh, just... Oh, we've got more throwing weapons. Nice. I didn't notice that. Where's my other thrower? Here. 
There we go. Oh, throwers can have shields as well. What am I playing at? Bloop. Bloop. Much better. <sighs> Repair that. Oh, you can hang, hang out, hand out this armour as well. Two one tens. You get a one ten. You can get a one ten. We've got a hundred and five for you. Yeah, all good. Right, we're going to sell some stuff because our inventory is full, but like the really cheap shit that no one cares about. Cool hat has to go eventually. Might as well be now. Good morning, working mate. Okay, cool. Having a break between calls, so I joined to say hello. Well, thanks for joining, mate. I really appreciate that. Hope your work goes well for the rest of the day when you do leave. Any bros? No. Don't suppose it's an easy fight, is it? Two nomads. Two nomads we can do. I think. I'm pretty sure we can do as long as we roll well. We put in Lance the light tank. Caravan man behind him. And the guy with the best stats. This guy. With the best armour. Actually no, you've got only one less but four more attack. So you're better but you're missing half the armour. Shit, half the armor's still missing. I wanted that to be 190 for this fight. He should still be okay, but if they've got a two-handed cleaver or something, he'll be get he'll get fucked. We should make sure this guy goes on the two-handed cleaver guy. We should be fine. Two nomads is doable, and we want the money. Um, where is it? You, you go here. You. You go here. Yeah. Okay, one of them's got a whip, so it's completely irrelevant, and the other guy's got a mace, so you just do this. Shield you there. Step up. And you come here. And you're done with this. extra cash that's nice you swap with him you swap with him and we're all good yeah I think now we're just gonna pick up this contract there's nothing else here for us is there save it after doing the arena so I don't forget and miss it or whatever I don't know 
we do end up loading for some crazy reason. Perfect, they're down over here. Let's go kill them. Flying tents, many cutthroats and some slingers. Oh, that's so sexy, super easy. Just lots of XP for us. Right guys, I'm gonna run to the loo and recharge my glass. I'll be right back in just a moment. Thank you so much for your patience.
Right guys, I'm back. Thank you so much for your patience. Let's see what these fools try and do to save their skins. They charge us recklessly. Waiting on everyone, allowing the archers to get shots off, and then we're stepping in and killing. I will tie the leper and I'll give them to you once I've dried them and made leathery tan nomad, it's, uh, whatever they're called, pelts for you. Oops, I meant to move there, but whatever. Skins, pelts have fur attached. Well, I'm assuming these nomads are excessively hairy. That's just the assumption I made about them. I could be wrong. Okay, we need more. We need fucking more tools again. Are you kidding? It's just the hunt for tools. It's all Battle Brothers is. Maybe because I play it, I don't play it as well as some other people. What's this? Three Nachzaras. One of them will be a level three, I think. So I think that's undoable. Not undoable, but very difficult. I suppose with only three of them, even if one person gets eaten, the other two are still locked down. How is these guys' armor? I reckon these three can do it. Sniper gets attack, fatigue, initiative. He gets... Let's give him fucking students so he levels up quick so you can see if he's good or not. Yes, yeah, so he's rolling threes. Which 
means he'll finish on about 90, which really sucks. 90 is not good for a sniper. You want it to be at least 100 to 110. So he's not going to be a good sniper. So he might not. I might look. For, I might keep looking for snipers and just get rid of him. Shit, man. The occultist gets attack, defense, and health. He gets. What can make him useful at this point? Like give him more accuracy and stuff. I suppose execution. A uh, backstabber would increase his accuracy, wouldn't it? Yeah. Let's backstabber him. Just to increase, so get something out of him. Best bro gets attack, defense, and hit points. Harry Beast would take offense to that. Well, we're not planning on scaring, on uh, skinning Harry Beast, are we? We value Harry Beast. Um, best bro, what should we give this guy? He's not gonna. The thing is, we need to get. He's got really good defense and offense, but low fatigue and really bad resolve. It's so funny, our best guy is a 40 gold refugee. So funny. <laughs> it just always makes me laugh. Uh, well, if you want him to survive, I think we give him steel brow at this point. Yeah, Steel Brow, just so he survives a bit longer. We don't want him, because he did, he just proves he needed it. He survived with three hit points after that crossbow bolt to the head. So he, he proves he needs it. Caravan Man gets attack, defense, and health. He just keeps missing his fucking rolls. His, um, his attack rolls. All he's rolled is ones the entire game. It's just bullshit. We knew we are not going to use him, but come on, he's one more level and then we can bench him. Uh, so for this level, he doesn't need underdog because he's at the back row. Overwhelm, he doesn't have much initiative. Uh, what is he? He's literally nothing. He just needs to survive until then. So we'll give him nine lives to make sure he does survive. Nine lives and then nimble and then we bench him. Alstat, two days to the northeast. Where's uh, Alstat is the one all the way up here, isn't it? Yeah. I don't want to do that because I want to pick up missions. Well, how much are they paying? Why is... Oh, yeah. Okay. Never mind. Let's, ha let's see how much they're paying. Thing is, that probably will get stolen by... Or either get stolen or... Uh, we'll get attacked by mercenaries for it. Can we handle mercenaries now? I'm not sure, to be honest, is the answer to that. I don't think so. I don't think so. It depends what they were wearing, but it always depends on what they're wearing. What's the throw we're getting? Fast adaptation. Hey, that's rude. What's rude? Called him a guy old, he's only 40. No, I didn't mean old, I meant cheap. When I said he's 40, he's a 40 crown. He only cost us 40 crown to uh, hire him. He's a 40 crown refugee. He's like the cheapest guy you could find. Cheapest, most desperate guy on the planet, and he's our best soldier. <laughs> I worry about you, Cheddar. You might defect if someone offers you a significant portion of money. You might defect and fucking kill us all. Uh, I was thinking about doing this, the Nasseras. I think they can do it. Unless it's three, level three Nasseras, which is just really unfair. I don't see why they wouldn't be able to do it. If it's three level threes and the fight's over, they just you all get eaten in this game and you can't do anything. It's bullshit. It should be two level twos and a level three. Two level twos and level three, yeah. Uh, we should let them come into us. Are you gonna? Are you coming for us or what? Are we gonna? Are we gonna do this or what? Okay, we want to step 
to here, finish. Step to here, finish. Step to here, finish. Yeah, finish. Uh, we probably want to go on this. Yeah, I, th I thought I would kill him. He needs to adrenaline. Then. Oh, why can't you have enough fatigue? Oh dear. He's gonna get eaten. We come here, and then we we'll kill him next turn. He's going to be able to go there and eat, which sucks, but we can't do anything about it. Please kill this guy. Thank you. Whoa, look at that damage! Should have swung first. Okay, so we can't do this. Fucking hell, what were the odds on that? 57s! What the fuck? Why are they rolling 57s on a guy with a shield? Now he's rolling 71. We don't kill him, we're fucked. Luckily that was a headshot. We just did it. But no, I am willing to save Scott now, guys. That's why I saved it. I can't believe we weren't, um, we couldn't do that. That is such bullshit. Just on the bad RNG, well it's not bad RNG, it was running on 50%. This guy pulling out a shield, who was it? It was, I think it was you, wasn't it? Pulling out a shield, he's only got 35 defense, that's why. Okay, so level three Nasseras are still terrifyingly dangerous. We need to bear that in mind. Let's go. That's why you don't do arena. It's just, I always, I say that every time I play it. I'm like, oh, let's try it. You might win. It just, it's a gamble. It always is a fucking gamble. So it's like, oh, we might win. And then RNG plays its hand and you lose a bro. And it's just, what for? Like 300 crowns? Ooh, yay. Really valuable. Once you're a high enough level, you can stomp the arena. It's worth doing to get the plus 10 resolve. If you can be bothered to grind that much. But that's if you can be bothered to grind for fucking ages. We're not going to catch them, they're too far away. Fuck, they didn't have ambush trade routes. Oh, it's pissing me off. They never have fucking ambush trade routes. Even though they've got a fucking place nearby that's uh, attacking them, supposedly, they just don't have ambush trade routes. They're just like, no, no, why? Our trade routes. Are 100% secure. Yeah, we're selling at 228. It's fucking appalling. <sighs> I don't want to sell at better prices, sell the expensive stuff at better prices. 102 actually isn't bad. You can sell it for like 220 in some places. We're full on food. We might be able to sell it for a penny somewhere else. I don't think so though. There's no one here worth hiring, is there? No. I thought you didn't want to be the Irrational Axeman anymore, Flavius. It was quite funny for a while. It was a good little skit while it lasted. Right, we're fully repaired finally. We can take some battles. Is Chetty on? Yeah, everyone's on.
I'm going to buy tools and then go north. Do we hire this guy for 4k? Oh, another hunter. We have to roll him. I need a good sniper. He better be good. Come on, please be good. We need a fucking... Fuck! Why is it every fucking hunter tries to be a melee fucking cunt? Fuck off. He had 59 as well. Yeah, he's already rolled a 2. Yeah, fuck off. Irritating prick. Oh, I want melee defense. I'm a fucking archer. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. And that's all our money spent. We could probably buy a bird somewhere. But we need to carry. We need to go start. We need to save this as a bank so we can go north. So we can actually do stuff. Like go camp busting and things like that. If we can find camps. It's still only day 23. Good. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Okay, Flavi, no worries, mate. Uh, yes, we're going to kill this, please. Are they going to come towards us? They are good. <laughs> ah, it's night time soon. Oh, you are going to hit. Okay. They're having terrible luck with hunters. They're just... Sometimes it happens. If I needed more throwers, I'd use him, but we don't. Well, I thought you wanted... I thought you wanted a sniper as well. It's just we haven't found one that's really good. You want to go for the Assassin Ninja, though? Okay, no worries, Flavi. We'll find you one. We just don't have the money for it right now. Uh, I'm going into Attendorn to see if there's any missions, aren't I? Let's talk money. Tawa. We haven't been to Tawa yet, but it's all the way down there. I don't think I can be asked. We could come up here, see if there's a caravan coming, and then come down this way. That place doesn't have work for us, does it? No, because it's a castle type place, or whatever they're, they're called, Tawa. I don't think it's worth it. I think we're going to come up here and come up this way. They're more likely to be caravans coming down from the north. Last time we just came up this road, came up to here, and then came back, and it was extremely profitable for us. So I think we're going to do that again. Uh, let's go to... Is it worth? It's worth spending the night just to see if there's any more bros here. There might be another archer. Hooray! Companies gained renown. The Bannerman now has the sash, and he has rallied the troops. We can now fight undead. In theory, we could do with some whips though. Some whips would be nice for fighting undead. There is another hunter. There's two. We have to roll on them both. I need a good sniper. If they're both shit, I'm going to lose my mind. What are sale prices like here? Not very good. The dyes are quite cheap. We could buy the dyes. No, I'd rather buy the hunters. But then we're not going to have enough money for... We just have to sell cheap. 
Well, actually, they've only just appeared, haven't they? Let's buy the dyes, run them up to Alstad. The hunters have only just appeared. Let's, let's run up to Alstad, sell everything, come back, get the hunters. Kill anything en route. That's the plan. Like this. Wait. Finish. Just round it now. Let them come to us. Do we ever name the next three-starred melee attacker King Solomon? We haven't found a three-starred melee attacker yet. <laughs> we can name him King Solomon if you want. If we ever actually find a three-star attacker. Do we have one? I can't remember. I think we've only got two stars. Yeah, only two stars. You've got the only three stars in the party, Lance. And that's on... Oh, no, you've got a couple of other three stars. But then shit like range defense and just irrelevant bullshit. Oh, he's got three stars as well. But you've easily got the best defense, Lance. Because you're a light tank, buddy. Uh, wait. Wait. I don't know what you're doing. You have to come to us eventually. Well, let's just kill him. Oops, I didn't... Meant to move there. Fucking hell. Meant to fucking... Adrenaline rush and misclicked. Press the right button. So it's going well, basically, is what I'm saying. The battle is going extremely well so far. It's lucky they're just cretins who don't mean anything. Cleaver. Let's go to our stand and sell it. Okay, they're chasing someone else, luckily, so we can come back onto the road. They obviously saw someone else and decided to chase them instead of us, which is lucky. Okay, Alstad doesn't have Amish trade routes, but they've still got... This is what I mean. Look how good the selling prices are. Imagine if they had Amish trade routes for once. Sale price is a 240, yeah, we're gonna sell here. This is the best we've seen in a while. You can get a bit more normally, but it needs to have Amish trade routes, like I said. We don't need three extra arming swords. We don't need three extra flails. We don't need these daggers. We only need six cleavers. Crossbow can go, hunting bow can go, that can go. Right, much better, 6k. Any bros here worth hiring? No, let's go get those hunters and hope that one of them's a good sniper. At the moment we're burning through crowns. Okay, they're going round, they're leaving. I don't know what they're doing, but they're not interested in us, that's for certain. Um, we are burning through crowns, just trying to find a sniper at the moment. Hopefully get a good roll on those hunters. Yeah, exactly. Taking bets on a famed two-handed sword. Well, you reckon that'll be the first item we find? The first famed item we find will be a two-handed sword, is that what you're saying? Okay, they're being defensive for some reason, maybe because it's night time, but I'm annoyed. <laughs> yep, 
You dick, I'm just gonna shoot you down. Even if it's night time, I can shoot a standing target. See? Fucking idiot. Ow. <laughs> I'll never forget that. I know exactly that godlike foe that uh, he ran off with after we sacrificed someone. <laughs> that was so stupid of me. I completely forgot that that was something that happened. And uh, yeah, we got the famed armor, but it just wasn't... Well, it was worth it, but it was made less worth it by the fact that the famed bow disappeared with it. Oh, it was so funny. Fucking known cheater. He was a cheat in the end. I knew we shouldn't have treated him. We shouldn't have trusted him. You can't trust someone called known cheater. That's for certain. Thing. Literally nothing but oh, there's some cheese. There's one, two pieces of cheese on the cart, apparently. Fucking no wonder they're peasants. They're like, oh, this cheese is so valuable. <laughs> we have to guard it with our lives. <laughs> So stupid. Uh, okay. Complete eight contracts. Yeah, we'll do that. Right, one of these hunters had better be the shit. Thorismund. Without his father around, Thorismund's mother taught him how to shoot a bow. Well, that's a bad start, isn't it? <laughs> Not being sexist or anything. But if you're taught by your mother, unless she's like a super famed huntress or something, then it's probably not a great start. Uh, when his wife fell ill. Thorismund shoots one arrow high into the sky, another one, he knocks it out. Impressive. Alright. We roll on Thorismund or Ragnar? Ragnar once took a bet to shoot an apple off a pig's head. He missed with a belly full of bacon. He became determined to never miss again. Unless it meant more bacon, of course. Oh, I love this guy. Once employed by local royalty, a disastrous boar hunt ended with a gourd baron and all the blame and blood on Ragnar's hands. Any outfit could use dead eyes such as this man. Maybe she was an elf. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Right, we're going to take Ragnar because he loves bacon. No other reason. Oh, great. He's bullshit. He wants to be a fighter. He's paranoid. He's got reduced initiative. He doesn't have any stars. He's trash. Ragnar, get lost. Fucking magic. Thorismund. What the fuck is this? What is with this range bullshit? I would have preferred him to have three stars in melee defense than range defense. At least could have used him as a frontliner then. So that's like four hunters who are absolute shit. Oh, I'm so fucking angry. Let's go kill some shit. This is bullshit. This is actually bullshit. Fucking hunters with fucking three star range defense and nothing else. Or fucking melee attack or whatever. Melee defense. Not melee defense, melee attack. Ah, oh, I can't even talk anymore. I'm so angry. That goes all our fucking money. We could have bought someone like... We could have bought so much stuff with that. Uh, right, we need to go kill stuff. Let's go to Dornheim and see if there's any work to be done. Oh, they're running away from us. So there'll be one donkey, one war dog. So that takes them down to seven. 
They're actually running away from us. I didn't realize that's what they're doing. Are they scared of us? I don't think we could take them. We don't have the accuracy to hit through their shield wall just yet. We don't have any ranged weapons to kill the polearm users. The Arbalista would fuck us up because it's the middle of the day. I'm just thinking the Billman might be worth it. How many footmen would there be? I think there's only three footmen there. I think we can probably take that. It would be a nice kill for us if uh, we could take that. We're at full health. Let's fucking go for it. I didn't realize they were running away from us. Oh, nice high ground as well, but I don't think we're going to be able to take it. Because of the what the fuck? How many fucking footmen? It said some footmen. One, two, three, four, five. There's one donkey. So that's six. One dog. That's seven. So there's one billman. It said a few billmen. Not a billman. At least I think it did. We want to kill this dog so I can move forward, but I can't. Take the high ground, Lance. Good. Come up onto the high ground. Adrenaline rush. Shit man can come up. Because we don't care if he dies. What the fuck? There's no donkey. Oh shit, what am I thinking? It's not a fucking supply caravan. Oh, I was being an idiot. I was thinking it was a supply caravan. It's not. It's a noble army. It's just a very weak one. Shit, I completely uh, miscalculated this. Anyway. Shall we come upwards? Uh, I completely miscalculated. I can't put him there. That would suck. Put him here. Finish. You there, Tyler. Right. You can just shield wall, buddy. That's what you're going to be doing for this fight. Mostly fit shield walling in the middle. Shame that didn't hit. I want you around here, Merton. Shit man can shield wall as well. 43, 36, 25. Ah! Good hit, caravan man. Yeah. Shetty can come up and start threatening these guys. He's good enough to take on a pole guy, I think. 49, 54. Barely doing any damage because we've got headshots. Eighteen, 
19. Put him in the body, thank you, and you'll kill him. Thank you very much. That's what I was about to say. Literally, as I was saying, get him in the body and you'll kill him. Jetty can go there and finish. Force these guys to run away. Shield wall. It's not going to work if I throw a javelin in your butt, is it? Oh, I forgot. He can't do this. So put the arrows on the ground. He can't. If he needs to use, if he wants to use the bow, he can't use the shield. Found a gift for the missus yet? Yeah, that's a good question. What did you go for in the end, Lance? Thank you. That. <clears throat> oh, he can't either. So we need to get we need to give one of them throwing weapons, really. Yeah, we slaughtered these guys. The hill helped. The hill definitely helped. Oh shit man might die right at the end. Oh he saved him. He saved him boys, he saved shit. We probably want his armor. Can we get his armor? Probably not anymore. Let's try and get his armor. It might be 150. Don't know what it is. It's probably 130. Right, we can get his armor now. Just need to dagger him down. But we probably won't get it. Well, we, we've got higher in chance of getting it because we're uh, scavengers or whatever. Barbarian start, you know? Whatever, we got a couple of 130s, got another hammer, nice, another arming sword. That was a very nice fight. Right, 130s for the boys. So, Best Bro gets a 130, Flail Man gets a 130, Lance, Light Tank gets a 130. What's that? 150 as well for you, Lance. You get a flat top now. You guys can keep heater shields in your inventory now instead of um, 
those ones. We repair the hammer, the pike, and this. Oh, that can go on one of these one of these throwers actually. Oh no, throwers can have a minus one vision helmet, can't they? Because they've got less range than an archer. Yeah, cool. That's fine. So we've got these to hand out if we want to give them to anyone. No, everyone's wearing his... Oh no, wait, you need 115. That's 90, you can go up to 110. And then you want these guys in nimble gear. It can be 110. It can be 110. You can be 105. We save that armor. That armor's... Oh no, it's not really good nimble gear. Southern Mail Shirt is the really good nimble gear, isn't it? With the hyena attachments. So we could probably sell some of these. Actually, we don't need the 95s. We've got the 110s. Sniper gets attack. So he's rolling threes. Thrower gets attack, fatigue, initiative. Uh, throwing mastery. This guy almost died, he's fine. Shelly's actually got 68 attack now, 70 attack. That's good enough for an arming sword, I think. So there's a bit more damage now, which is nice. We've still got two people using spears, so that's spear wall established. He's using a flail, that's fine. Yeah, all good. I didn't realise what they were doing for a while. I thought they were running off or chasing someone. I didn't realise we were powerful enough to kill fucking nine. Oh, we're buying those. Super cheap. Uh, we've got plenty of provisions. We don't need anything else. We're just buying the dies. Seeing if there's a mission here. Tawa. Why is everyone going to Tawa? Alright, whatever. Just come back up to Outstart. we got 12 bros, we can probably start camp busting again, but we need to find camps. Last time we went out into the wilds, we didn't find anything. We just wasted, wasted away, basically. Mm, don't really fancy cultists for no reason. Let's clear out the inventory of all the trash that we don't want. Especially when we've got a hammer now. Well, we've officially stabilised, guys. That's something, at least. Do the cargo to Tawa. Why are they all going to Tawa? Fuck off. Ugh, and a caravan work to the north. All right. It's just games being bullshit. Wobbly shelter. On the plains to the north. Wobbly shelter. We should probably go kill it. It's on the plains to the north. It's up here. Let's go kill Wobbly shelter. And then we'll come over to the road. Ah, oh, brilliant. We've got another retinue. So, we've got two retinue now. We're not going to take the recruiter because we're going to recruit from one city, so it's not worth it. From one one province, two people hate us. Uh, we might take the blacksmith. Yeah, I think we'll take the blacksmith, and then we'll take the then we'll take the scout. As soon as we can take the scout, we're close. So I think we need two more fights. One more fight, yeah. 
We need one more fight against uh, Beast and then we'll be able to get the scout. But I'll take the blacksmith and you can help repair stuff. 26 hours, yeah. On the plains to the north. Where is it? Where? Okay, I can't find Wobbly Shelter, so fuck it, we're gonna just leave it. It's probably not worth finding. No idea where it is. He said on the plains to the north, which should be up around here. We couldn't find anything, so we're just gonna leave it. Die, trading caravan! Okay, let's round it. This guy's dangerous because he can he can puncture. That guy's dangerous because he has a spear. So let's go. Transporting strange meat, apparently. A bunch of meat. It was a meat wagon. <sighs> Come up to this town. We haven't been in this town for ages. There might be something there. Don't know what. Cheap tools. I think tools are pretty cheap there. We need another 70 or so. To max out. I'm not saying we need to max out, but if we're going to go up the road... Good, we got there by nightfall. There is another hunter here, we can afford to roll on him. Fuck! <sighs> Shit. We got a fucking tank who's afraid of green skins. That makes him fucking useless in green skin fights. Such bullshit. I saw the three stars there and I was like, is that ranged attack? And I thought it was. The, the fear of green skins would be irrelevant if he was a sniper because you don't use archers in fucking green skin fights. They're useless. Three star fucking, he'll finish on about 33 melee defense, which isn't even that good for a tank. Plus, he's afraid of green skins, so he'll just run away when we're trying to tank with him against green skins. Plus, his fatigue's really low, and he's only got two stars in it anyway, so he, does, he doesn't have that much. He's only got 50 hit points, so he's a bad fucking tank. He's a really bad tank. That's the best you can do with him, and he's a shit archer. We are getting some serious trash at the moment, guys. This is just bollocks. Fuck you, game. Yeah, prices are super cheap here. Do we even have enough? Oh, I think I may have bust us, guys. When was the last time I saved? I'm just thinking I might end the stream. Day 25. 
Well, I just wrecked us. I just, just completely, we have to head. We've got nothing to sell. We got a little bit to sell, but not very much. And, um, I just spent all our money by mistake on that hunter. Which means we now need to come all the way back to here and pick up work because we don't have enough money to kill anything. How many days do we have? One more day. Let's do two more days. Get enough money for two more days. Come down here, along here, collect anything we can, and then down to our stat. So we have to sell here for enough for two days. We got plenty of provisions. So that that's a good start. Don't need these archer stuff. Don't need this stuff. We don't. We just don't have anything to sell. And selling prices are abysmal. Is that enough for two more days? Yeah, it is. Okay, that's fine. So we'll sell enough for two more days. We'll come down here. Uh, we'll come down here, up to here. We'll kill anything that we can. We'll come back down to Outstand. I think I'm going to end the stream there, guys. Let's save it, because I haven't saved in fucking ages for some reason. I see something there? Don't know. Yeah, I keep something keeps flashing up there, but we're miles away from it. Aha, another company. We're probably gonna wreck them. A few billmen, a few arbalesters. We might get wrecked by them though. Let's give it a go. Let's fuck them up. We're not going to get wrecked by them, but we could easily lose someone if they get a good position. Oh, they ran into the woods. There's 15 brigands there. Lots of thugs. I'd much rather get these guys. No one cares about the thugs. The arbalesters are dangerous. They could easily kill someone. Oh, we've got high ground again. But we're not going to be able to get it because they're going to take it. Yeah, the arbalesters are fucking dangerous. Yeah, they're going to get the high ground. That sucks. Two bill hooks would be nice. He's hitting uphill, unfortunately. There's nothing I can do about that. I maybe could have moved him here, bumped him back, but then I'd be in the same position here, and I'd much rather bite behind, be behind the bush for cover. Uh, Shitman can take on one of these guys. No. Shitman goes up on the high ground. He might be okay, actually. Shield wall. Shetty can come here and finish to protect against him. Yeah, I don't like their positioning. They got, they've got. We had really good positioning in the last one. They've got really good positioning in this one. So if some he goes here, someone can go there and hit down, but. If he goes, I don't know. I just don't know what to do with them. They've got a really good position here. We just need to break through it. We don't have the power. We do not have the power, Captain, to break through. Plus, it's daytime. Those Arbalisters are going to do so much damage. Yeah, we're just hitting into a heater shield. This is a fight. This this last battle we had the advantage because of the terrain. This is what happens when we have the disadvantage. And the Arbalisters are just wrecking us and this is not a fight we're going to win. You need blood, do you, Lance? You're going to get blood. It's going to be your comrade's blood. This guy's already dead. Didn't know he could step in there and do that. <sighs> They've tied us up really nicely here. Ugh. 
Yeah, he's dead. We should have fallen back, actually. If they were coming forward, which they were, what we should have done is fallen back to here rather than trying to move forward into the high ground position. That was a mistake on my part. I might try this battle again, but then the terrain will be different. Yeah, we've lost this one. They're gonna, they've killed one guy already. They're going to just completely slaughter us. From, they've got such a good position. With this high ground bullshit. I made the mistake of moving forward and I should have moved backwards. I wasn't paying attention to. Like I said, I was going to end the stream and I should have ended it before this battle. I'm just feeling a bit fatigued. Ready to go. I'm going into work tomorrow. I've been streaming all week. I think I've had enough of it. Um, so I'm not really... My heart's not really in this battle and I'm not really paying attention. Uh, we're going to... I'm working over the weekend, guys. So... Uh, yeah, not going to be streaming until Monday afternoon. Will be the next stream. Um, finally he died. But then another one will just take his place. Watch this guy just step up and take this position. There's that guy. Even if I try and preserve men, we're still going to get a bunch of them killed. Oh, I should have moved him backwards, actually. That was silly. Yeah, this is just annoying me. I don't, I don't even know why I'm playing it, to be honest. I already knew that was a, a loss as soon as I fucked up. Right, guys, I'm going to end the stream there. We're going to load... Um, we're going to load from the save I made and we're going to try this fight when I'm properly fresh and I can be bothered to do it. Uh, that'll be on Monday afternoon. I'm going to be working all weekend. I'm looking forward to going into work actually. Having a week off and just streaming has been great fun. But you just kind of, at the end of the week, you just kind of get a bit fed up of it. And you want to break up. You want to meet someone and talk to people and stuff like that. So I'm looking forward to socializing. I'm looking forward to the challenge of being at work. And I'm looking forward to getting paid for it as well. So yeah, that'll be my weekend, guys. I hope you all have a good one. I'm not sure what you're up to. Let me know in the comments down below what you're up to over the weekend. Uh, I'd be interested in finding out, seeing what some of you guys are doing. I hear, I know Flavius will probably be riding his motorcycle. God, you see a Monday, are you gonna play War Tales tonight? No, I'm not. I'm done with streaming for the week, I think. Uh, thanks for asking, Lance. Sorry I wasn't on yet War Tales yesterday as well. I got tied up doing a bunch of stuff. Like washing up and calling the bank and a few other things. And by the time I'd finished doing them all, it was quite late in the afternoon. And I didn't. I had already, I already had evening plans, so I didn't want to just rush the War Tales stream. Uh, but I'm done with streaming now. I need to get ready for work. So I'm, I'm looking forward to going into work, but I need to spend the afternoon getting ready to go into work. Like getting stuff prepared and... Yeah doing a few bits and bobs around the house, cleaning and whatnot. Um, so I'll be back Monday afternoon um, with more Battle Brothers and then Tuesday morning with Battle Brothers. Wednesday, Tuesday, then uh, Tuesday we're going to be getting Call of Cthulhu back online, hopefully, as long as no one's sick. And then Wednesday will be a Battle Brothers morning and a War, Tile, War Tales afternoon. So yeah, hopefully see you all there for that, guys. If not, I'll see you in some other content. It's okay, you're allowed to have a life, bud. <laughs> Thanks. Praying for a drive late December to TN from Florida. Okay, good luck. That's really cool. Yeah, guys, catch you later. Really appreciate you being here. So I'll wait till next time. <laughs>